Hey everybody, this is GliderCat and it's time to play. We are back in Space Trash Scavenger. Uh, let's get back to it just before hitting record. I did a lap. Oh, let me get that piece of scrap. I did a lap around our huge planet here. I collected up a bunch of drifting trash and on my way back, <laughs> I noticed our base came under attack. Uh, so I took out the three hostiles, but man, they left some damage behind. Let's, uh, let's get going. Let's get going. Let's process some uh, stuff in the atomizer here. I collected, like I said, a ton of trash. Uh, so let's get this all put in. Boom. Boom. In fact, it looks like our atomizer had some stuff to do already. Trash, trash, trash. Okay, get that thing going, and then I'm going to get the repair gun out. Uh, and we're going to get to work fixing things. Yeah, they did the job on the old base here. Fortunately, these blocks seem to be pretty strong. What's going on? Am I missing resource or something? This doesn't seem to be repairing very quickly. But I guess it's it's repairing. We're going to need more jetpack fuel. We're going to need to eat. We're going to need all kinds of stuff. But let's get some of this repair going. I think these all look good. There's a block that needs help. This all looks repaired. Let's just check these guys. Alright, that is all repaired. Let's get some uh, biofuel algae going. Start by type. I'm going to take half my carbon and throw that in there. Get that going. And then we need to come into the fabricator. And I want... Looks like I have a fair amount of algae actually already. I've got two med packs. We're going to need to use those. Let's do... Let's queue up at least a couple med packs. Probably three of those. And then jet pack fuel. About three of those. Yeah, we don't have a lot of hydrogen and oxygen, do we? Throw some more stuff into the atomizer. Get that going. All right. All right. All right. Oh, one more thing. You guys pointed out that I think in last episode or the second episode, I missed something and it was on one of these carbonite rocks. Let's see if we can zoom in. There was like an airlock on one of these that we missed. Pretty sure it was a carbonite rock. Let's scan this one. That we've already done. These we've re we've scanned before. I'm not sure why they're making us scan them again. Where is that rock? Asteroid. If I can't find it, we'll just skip it. Man, I thought it was one of these, but I don't see it. Uh, it might be that thing right there. On top of there, there's an airlock that we didn't explore. Um, we might be able to get that on the way over to the nano factory. That's really what we want to take on this episode. All right, let's, uh, there's our jump gate. And our furnace. Back over here. There's all our <laughs> all our million cubits. All right, let's heal up. Boom. And let me just see those numbers. One more. And then eat a bunch of food. Ninety eight. Eighty six. One more. And then jetpack fuel. Let's get that. On the hot bar was that created? I don't. There it is. Okay, that's a little bit better. More cubits. Let's go to the nano factory. Where is that guy? Might be on the other side. 
Uh, let's look at the map. Yeah, it's directly straight on the other side. And let's see if we can run by one of these carbonite rocks. Asteroids, I should say. Uh, and see if we can get that thing that I missed. I think it might be this one right there. Let's, I'm going to head off. Let's do it. We're going to circle the planet, make our way over to the nano factory. But I just want to stop here. See if I can get the airlock thing that I missed last time. I think it's right there. And then, yeah, we'll get out of the sector. When we get into the new sector, the next one, um, then I want to spend a little bit of time building out our space rig. We know we need more power. Um, I'd like to maybe check out the farm blocks. We'll do that in the next sector. I kind of want to get this one cleared. Okay, where I'm headed is right for this guy. Grapple myself in here in a minute. Boom. And I think it was right here. A couple viewers actually pointed this out. There it is. Right up top here, there's a... Whoops. Might be harder to get than I thought. Yeah, it's an little airlock hatch here. It may not be anything super useful, but let's do it just for completion's sake. circuit breaker and a big piece of iron probably that was all but it was kind of on our way we need to go right there entity nano factory oh you know what we didn't get we didn't get ammunition i just ran through all of my ammunition hmm think we should go back oh, i hate to waste the fuel but i or we could try to take this on with just our laser gun we're going to pay the price. Our mining laser. <laughs> Should we try and take them on with just the mining laser? Let's do it for the sense of adventure. That'd be the wisest choice. We're heading in here. Is this it? Yeah, our nano factory. And there's a structure here that we want to take out. And so we may circle this asteroid till we find the structure. I think it... No, that's not it. That's just a chest. Must be on the other side. It's lit up. Well, there's a couple explosive drums. Let's get over there. Keep your fingers crossed so we can pull this off with just the mining laser. May not be the wisest choice. Oh, uh, while we're coming up this way, is there anything we missed here? Doesn't look like there's anything we can harvest off that side. It looks like maybe we already emptied out the... Uh, Airlock on that structure. See an enemy there off to the left. I don't know if that's gonna that guy's gonna come bother us or not. There's also a piece of trash over here. Probably not worth grabbing. Although maybe we can. Let's head down this way. Looks like we are going to have to fight that guy off. We do have... Actually, I should probably put med packs back on the hot bar. Let's do that. That one doesn't look like it has an airlock on top of it. All right, I'm going to keep my mining laser handy here. Just kind of circling because I think I may want to take some things out while we're floating around. Oh, there it is. I bet that's it. All right, let's keep our eyes peeled for enemies. That's the thing I think we want to take out. Actually getting some hits on it from far away. Oh, here comes one of our buddies. Not happy.
All right, awesome. Let's see if we can take this guy out. I think that's the structure that's going to get us what we need. Ooh, what's that thing? There's another one. Yep, another one just spawned in. Come on. How are we doing on health? Not great. Alright, that's the end of our med packs. We really have to take this thing out. So we're just going to have to think dodge, dodge bullets. But I think this is causing them to respawn. Could be wrong. Alright, nice. Took out the Entity Nano Factory. You'll automatically pick up the Entity Nano Factory remains if you have space in your suit inventory. We should. You'll need it to make jump drive fuel. Alright, now we need to survive. We got 65 health. Let's try and take these guys out as best we can. I'm walking, but I'm stuck on something. Come on. Health is a problem. Ouch. All right, we did it. We did it. I think we're in the clear. I think we're in the clear. I don't have any health. I can eat some food. I don't think that's going to really help our health. But, uh, all right, let's explore, see if there's anything else here. I'll keep the mining laser handy. Look for airlocks or anything that's destructible. I don't, I'm not seeing anything. Uh, we could drop our little miner bot off just to see if he finds anything for us. Uh, nothing but a landing pad up here. No mining bots coming back to inventory, I think. So no ore. Check the top of that one already on the way in. I see that stuff we can blow away. I don't think we can. Can we mine this? I think that was from one of the enemies, just some debris that fell onto the surface of the asteroid here. I'll just do a quick lap. See if we find anything. Yeah, that's useful. Oh yeah, the containers. Pumpkin. Uh, we have room. We'll take it. Thought there was another container somewhere too. We saw two yellow ones as we were draw as we were making our way on here onto here. Where might they be? Piece of something here we can grab. All right, that might be it. That might be it. I think so. If anything, there's one more container. I just can't seem to find it, but maybe there's just one. All right, let's get back to the space rig. Where are you, space rig? You are here. I'll scan this again. It looks like um, some of our scans were forgotten. Where are you? Oh, yeah, straight on the other side. 
Let's just head off of here. And get to the space rig. We could stop by the stock market, but I don't think we really have anything to sell. Health is down to 22. I've got jetpack fuel while we're floating here. Let's uh fill up. Or at least use up that last little cartridge we've got. I don't see any debris nearby. We've checked all of the asteroids. I think we've exploited every asteroid and I got most of the flying debris. Just about everything actually. Hopefully we're not under attack over here. We're coming up on this <laughs> coming up on the space rig. I do not have much health. So hopefully we have enough um of the right materials to make some uh med packs. Deficit. Yeah, we got a power deficit going on here. We're going to solve that when we get to the next uh, sector, I'm hoping. All right, look at all this. Nice, 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 nice. We have more to load in too. Let's do that first. Oops. Yeah, there's our nano fragment. I think that's what we need. These are all trash. I'm just going to double check. I don't want to scrap something that's essential. All right. Atomizer on. We need med packs and we need this fuel. Jump drive fuel. Let's do that first. Boom. Entity base cubit. Oh, we must have to... We must have to atomize that thing, huh? Let's see what it says. Space trash. Both man-made and alien has accumulated everywhere. Scavenge it and break it down with your atomizer. Entity base cubits. Okay, yeah, that's what we're gonna get when we scrap it. We're gonna have to atomize it. Uh, let's let this stuff process. In the meantime, we know we need med packs. Do I have what I need? I do. Awesome, we get a bunch of oxygen cubits when we just landed back on the station. Let's get a lot of these. One, two, three, four, five, six. How about eight queued up? And then we'll also do... Nice, we have hydrogen too. Let's do... I don't know, five of these. And then we got a little low power warning. I want to go on the other side here and just make sure these guys are turned off. Let's turn the furnace off. We're not using that right now. Jump drive soon. That guy doesn't take any power, I don't think. The blueprint shop. All right, let's load in the nano fragment. And I have some carbon or something. Atomize all that. Okay, we got med packs. Let's heal up. 40, 60, 80. And I will save the rest. More food. Okay. Alien runestone. Just checking out inventory. Tons of iron. We could build out the base a little while we're waiting for things to atomize. Why don't we do a little bit of that? Kind of want six more of these guys. One, two, three. What I'm thinking of doing, we'll do most of this when we get to the next sector. Oops, let me grab some more. A 
thinking of doing is putting a wall or some kind of array of solar panels up in this area, kind of extending up from our main platform here. I think I want a few more of these. And let's get a few of these. This one, this support cube, kind of looks like scaffolding. It says, connects different areas of your space rig using support cubes. Does not create gravity, so you can only be walked down when you're close enough to the base cubes. And does not block light on the face of solar cubes. So that is what we want to make our solar panels a little more effective. Let's grab six of these. Ooh, three iron cubits each. Okay, yeah, the same thing as the base cubes. We've got a bunch of iron. I'll show you what I'm thinking. Something like that. And then we grab one of our solar panels. Let's grab the packing tool. We haven't used this much. Let's take this last one off the end. Whoops. Forgot I had the packing tool on. Boom. Grab that solar cube. Something like that. And then back to these guys. Oops, wrong one. This. Ooh. This. Now the challenge is we're not going to be able to walk up there. Maybe we can put regular base cubes here or something. We'll have to see. Like this doesn't have gravity, so we, we'd have to kind of zoom up here to get to a block that does have gravity. Yeah, then we can put solar panels on the ends. Let's do that real quick. Packing tool, boom, boom. Oh, cool. We've got our entity base qubit. Let's throw that in and make our fuel for the jump drive. Boom. Get that going. See where I'm going with this? Thinking a big old solar wall. In fact, let's grab the couple more of these. This is going to get us more power because we'll have all six sides exposed to light. You can kind of see that now. A little icon in the middle showing that. Um, these ones would go here and here in theory. And then these guys going to be a little... We may have to get the jetpack out to do some of this building, but... You can kind of see where I'm going with that. Now the challenge though, the challenge is going to be when we get attacked, you know, getting up on this structure is going to be a little tricky because these scaffolding blocks I don't think have gravity. Could use glass. Anyway, that is a start. Do we have our jump drive fuel? We do. Awesome. Let's, uh, let's go jump to, or let's see what Tracy has for us. Okay. When you've crafted some jump drive fuel, jump to your next salvage sector. That's what we're doing. Hop over. We got one more solar panel we'll move later. All right, let's get out of here. Scavcorp grants your jump drive subspace access to a series of designated salvage sectors. You can plot your destination when you activate the drive. But take care. Once you jump, there's no going back. Make sure you've done everything you want to before you go. All right. Hmm, I'm surprised we can't come back, right? Because we... We saw that some of the asteroids had that ammonium rock or stuff that that required a stronger mining laser. Let's just take a look at um, at the blueprints for a second. Yeah, we only have this 
mining laser available to us. I just want to see if there's a stronger mining laser before we leave this sector. Let's look at the blueprint shop. Is there something we could buy? Laser rifle level two. Uh, we're going to want that, but what I really want right now... Oh, man. Better grapple guns, better trash facts, definitely. Gold cubits, we'll have to find gold. Mining laser two, yeah, 20 titanium cubits. Do we even have that titanium cubits yet? Doesn't look like it. So we're, yeah, we're not able to do anything else in this sector, I don't think. Let's, uh, let's head out. Jump drive. Proceed. Pop that in there. Initiate. Now we got to pick a sector. I was looking at this earlier. If we wanted to cover everything, which I kind of do, we need to pick like a little path through here. So maybe here, 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 here. I don't know. Here, 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 here. Something like that. Let's uh, let's go here. First, okay, asteroid cluster, four asteroids, one rack, three trash clouds, a nano factory. That gets us our fuel to get out of here. A distress signal. Maybe these guys, maybe this will be someone that can give us something. Some kind of cool piece of equipment. No outposts. No abandoned vehicles. Danger level one. Stock market, yes. These two look identical. And then this one's going to be a little different. Uh, this one's got a bunch of asteroids. Let's head here. This might be a good place. All right. Congratulations on your first successful jump. As you progress, Scav Corp sends you stock orders to fulfill at stock markets. Check your goals, see what they need. You can see how to make stock by looking in your blueprints menu in the stock tab. Stock orders persist between jumps. You may need to jump salvage sector in order to get the resources you need. Okay. All right. Something happened with the lighting here. I think I'm going to save. Yes. Unless this is like some weird dark sector. I have a feeling there's a, just a problem. Yeah. Not sure what happened there. I'm going to exit out and reload and see what we get. Here we go. All I did was hit save game and we're fine. All right, what do we have going on here? Let's do some scanning. Okay, asteroid type 9410. It's not telling us anything about it. Hmm. Take a look. Yeah, that looks like that ammonium, right? We need a stronger mining laser. Maybe we can get that while we're in this sector. Uh, looks like there's some space trash up there. I don't see any enemies flying around. Oh, yep, yep, yep. It's all fine. What else we got over here to scan? All fragment. Unknown. Let's scan that one. Carbonite. I can see we've got a little buddy there waiting for us. Uh, there we go. Wreckage. Another buddy. Squid. Looks like an ice asteroid. Yeah, let's take a little closer look there. Take some trash, some ice. Might want to get to second mining drone before we go there. There's just a bunch of trash floating around. What else? Silicate asteroid. Bunch of floating trash. Nothing new, nothing we haven't seen before. What else? Explored. Stock markets. Unknown. There's our bad guys. Explored. What's this one all about? Let's take a look. Oh, artifact. Very cool. And where's our planet? Is it 
epic braid thing? Oh man. Okay, now let's look at the map. I guess there doesn't look like there is a big planet. There's just the sun in the distance, maybe. All right, so one, two, three, four, five big asteroids, one little asteroid, and then one piece of floating structure for us to explore. Uh, before we do all that, let's do a little bit more work on our base. And I want some more building blocks. Do I have any other trash here that we need to get rid of? It doesn't look like it. I think we're good. On that, we got plenty of food. Let's just build out this platform so it's a little more walkable. I want more than that. Let's get some more. What are we doing on iron? Oh, we got tons. Pack up the solar one for the moment. We can always replace these with the um, with the blocks that have the ports to place machines when we need to. I just want to have a decent sized structure that we can kind of walk around on. get the map out of the way. Uh, two more blocks. And let's get... Let's see. We have one solar panel. I'd like to do... Yeah, one, two, three. Four, five. Let's do... Four more solar panels. Because we've got one in inventory. These blocks here and here. And these guys only have one of those left, huh? Let's get a few more of these. Two more is good. Build out our solar array a little bit here. Now we shouldn't have power problems. That's looking pretty good. I like it. Very cool. We can extend that thing out. Um, eventually, we probably want to build the platform a little further. Let's do that. Uh, how about... One, yeah, one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Nine, ten. I want to be able to walk to the other side in case we're getting attacked. So back here. Very cool. I like it. I like it. All right. We're getting started. Not bad. Tell you what, let's wrap this episode here, though. Next episode, let's go start scavenging, scavenging some trash. I think what the first thing we might want to do, though, uh, is actually go find that signal. Wasn't there a, was there a signal in this one? Yeah, there's a signal. And where is it? Is it in the sun? We're here. Oh yeah, I need to sleep too. Yeah, I want to go after the signal just in case there's an NPC that's going to give us something. Maybe they'll give, maybe they'll give us the stronger mining laser. There it is, straight up there. So we'll head there next episode. Um, I'm going to sleep and eat in between episodes, and then we'll be ready to go. But yeah, that's it for this one. War analysis Gladder Cat saying thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoy this series on Space Trash Scavenger. What a cool game. I really, really, really like this game. Anxious to see how things progress as we move through these sectors. I want to thank Gladder Cat patrons and channel members for their support of the channel and thank those of you that have provided some suggestions and comments. Appreciate that as well. I'll see you all in the next episode.